So now I look like a giant compared yeah. to you. Everybody ever, I noticed people in the comments were like, is Octo actually three feet tall? And no, Jesse yeah. is just a giant of a this man. This is, this is basically what we're, this is. Uh, I am, I am average height no, for a human. No, this is like that perspective shit they do in. Oh, uh, where they draw the, the chalk, rings. where they draw, draw the chalk thing on the ground and it looks like you're standing on the edge of a building. I was going to say like Lord of the Rings, how oh. they made everyone look like hobbits, but yeah. Oh, that that's too. Fine. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Uh, Okay. People were like, aren't you going to change the difficulty? We did say we'd change the difficulty. Do you want to? Okay, so I will warn you. Okay, I I, I have... Okay, let me say this. Uh -huh. I have decided I'm not going to backseat as much. What? I don't want to. Because I feel maybe it ruins the experience. So I, I, will, what? I will keep that to a minimum. What? But on the flip side, conversely, I don't know a lot of the answers to puzzles coming up. In fact, I don't know most of them. What? So it... One more time? What? Yeah, okay. It, I don't know the answer to most of the puzzles coming up, so this is going to be an adventure for both of us. Oh, man. I didn't want an adventure. I signed on for a science mission, not this shit. Lieutenant Captain Ensign. Uh, let's try Lieutenant, Lieutenant, and if it sucks, we'll, we'll we can go load. back. We'll load and, mm -hmm. and try it different. Uh, load. Shitty Combatu? Uh, I think that's the one we were at. I think so. That sounds right. Yes. Where are we going? Outpost by. Oh, right. Because remember, um, we all of a sudden found out that a bunch of Romulan warbirds were uh, coming to attack Helm. an outpost. Standard orbit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like how the background noise, the like ambient audio, yeah, yeah, yeah. has a distinct cut point. You can hear it. Like there. You hear that? Like. Let me, let me hear. Yeah, I hear it. Yeah, yeah it doesn't. Loop it drives me right. crazy. The yeah. loop is very, very bad. Mm -hmm. I don't know who made this game. Who made Spectrum Holobyte? It's like this game is I'm almost write, twenty years old. I'm gonna write a strongly worded I'm letter. I'm gonna write the strongest worded letter. View screen. Yeah, what's up? Oh, what? There's not a planet there. I thought we had an outpost. Wait, wait, wait. Talk to talk to Data. What about this? Guy? Any suggestions, number one? I'm sorry, Captain. I don't what? Mr. Data, any? Su I suggest we contact. These guys Counselor, never have helpful, any thoughts? ever. They're never helpful. I'm sorry, Captain, but I don't I, have any suggestions right Worf, now. If Worf is the only one helpful right now, right? we are truly in the darkest time. They of genuinely life. have nothing good to say, any of these people. Let's go like that. All right. Yeah. Um. Uh, maybe, maybe we just... Uh, maybe we do contact... Go to comms. Oh, Commander, Commander Chan. Chan. Greetings, Captain. I can't Whoa, tell you I... how glad we are to see the Enterprise. Oh, I can tell. Wait, time out. Yeah. Is that the first real person? No, because um, the ad the two admirals we've contacted before have been like FMV people with the, an the weird animated mouth. Do you think these are people who worked on the game? I would not be surprised. Because I just... Uh, okay, hold on. You oh, know what? You know what? The blinking assist. makes it more What can awkward. you tell us about the invasion? The first wave seems to have passed through the sector already. There were dozens of warbirds. We thought we were done for, but they just kept going. They didn't even attempt to attack? No. It looks like no. they were headed for the Zatarnus Nebula. We don't know why. Are there any other ships in the area? The USS Ayers came through a few hours ago, but they headed off to intercept a group of warbirds. The Klingons have promised to send us support, but... But we've just detected some incoming warbirds. Uh oh, damn. They're headed for Com Relay 543 in the Paxonoma system. Captain, we can't afford to lose another Do I really station. have to fight again? I don't know how fighting works in this game. And now we just up the difficulty. Okay, so here's the other thing that I should note about <laughs> difficulty in this game. Oh. Yes, the combat is more annoying. Two, on higher difficulties, you have to manually input where you want to go. It doesn't just autopilot you. So, you see how it says COM Relay 543 in the Paxonoma system? Uh-huh. You have to remember that. Commander, the Enterprise is a match for a single warbird, but against any more than that, we risk losing the ship. Captain, we need those relays intact to coordinate our defenses. So far, the Romulans have used only hit-and-run tactics. They don't seem to want to fight. If the Enterprise shows up, 
it might be enough to chase them off. This is going to be bad. So, All right, we'll see what we can do. Remember last time the Ferengi trader said that... Set were... course for the Pax Anona system. Oh, maybe Walk it automatically nine. does it. End game. Okay, never mind. It does this one. But anyway, so um, keep in mind that the Ferengi told us they were retrofitting all the for speed, not for power. So they're trying to get somewhere. And that was also um, hinted at again when she was like, they just flew right past. They just buzzed the tower, if you will. Look, look, I understand. Uh huh. But I'm letting you know. Uh huh. That this shit is about to get crazy. Oh, also, oh, yes. also for the right, we're warp nine. Oh my god! For the what? record, cruising. I just Admiral to, Williams here. Yeah, that's a real ass person. She seems more animate, like drawn. They than, might. They might have like rotoscoped her or something. Yeah, she seems like because this definitely this is like a animated body. Yeah, but I think her face is like a real ass face. Are you? They got out. She seems like these guys where they're drawn, yet this woman. Is there anything that's just else a person. Here? Yeah. That's just a person. That's, oh, that's just a person. You're right. Yeah. Unless, unless realism mm -hmm. means you're an alien. If ever, if the if normal people air quotes are animated, a FMV person must be an alien. Okay. Think about okay. that. Put that um, in your put that in your pipe and smoke it. Maybe maybe that's true. We'd like to replenish some of our organic supplies. Organic We'd like supplies. to replenish some of our organic supplies. <laughs> Riker's gone through them all, man. Send a requisition <laughs> to my supply chief, and we'll transport what we can spare to your ship. Okay. Okay. Thank Captain, you. three warbirds are oh, entering the system. Oh, shit, here we go. Uh -oh. They are not cloaked. Red alert. Shields up. <laughs> Riker's got Thanks, it. Thanks, right? Yeah, he's on yeah. top of it. Red he's alert. been waiting for that all day. I don't understand it. They're not even attempting to hide. Could it be some kind of trick? Hmm. It doesn't matter. Uh, Helm, get us out of here. We have to engage. We have to engage. Prepare to engage, Mr. Wolf. Captain, the Romulans are changing course. They are retreating. Intercept. Yeah. Helm, change course to intercept. It's time we found out what they're up to. Sir. One of the warbirds is breaking formation. Uh oh. It is turning to engage us. Let's I do mean, this. honestly, fuck the Romulans. They're assholes. Smash that shit. Full spread! It's, it's kind of crazy. You can, like, choose the phaser spread of the torpedoes. What do you mean? How do you miss phasers? How did we miss it? Red alert yet. status! Shields are. Look at it kind of just meandering Locking towards weapons. you. Fire. Torpedo locked. I think you killed it. My weapons were locked, away. apparently. Power. Damage to the sensor. Or Should I press it? Uh, weapons I did. It's locked. Oh, it's locked. Okay. Yeah. What is it doing? <laughs> it's trying to fly around, I guess. <laughs> this is space, and we're just standing still. Our phaser fire missed. What do you mean it missed? Lock on! Dwarf, that's your job. Torpedo. Can no I hail them? Hail. Look at this asshole, he's just flipping around. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's drifting over here. This is, this, is the, this is what it must feel like to be a Dark Souls boss. And it's just dodging them everywhere. <laughs> just like trying to get around and you keep hitting them over and, and over again. Fine. What do you mean warning? Torpedo away. Direct hit. <laughs> Wait, How are they still going? Click on, click on tactics. Torpedo locked. The shields warning. are holding. Do you see? Do you see? Um, Fire. Yeah. See tactics below yes. con. Try that. Attention, Whoa. 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 This is Captain Jean-Luc Picard of the Federation Starship Enterprise. Wow. I am Tiralak, commander see, of the Imperial drawn. Warbird yeah. Psyonex. Yeah. Your ship is crippled, Tiralak. I'm offering to beam you and your crew aboard the Enterprise. You will be well treated. No doubt. Unfortunately, we will not be able to accept your generous offer. Captain, energy emissions from the Cyanex are rapidly increasing. Oh, what the what? I believe they have activated their self-destruct system. Is that what that noise in the background is? It yeah. sounds like the ocean? Yeah, no. that must Back be us it. Off. I don't want us anywhere near that ship when it goes. Why did your ships cross the neutral zone, Tiralak? Surely you knew that you would be intercepted. Of course we did. 
Then what was the purpose? There was nothing to be gained from this. We gained far more than you realize. He's just saying that. Oh my god. Only a fool with what? Starfleet repellent invasion. This one's not gonna matter. Yeah. But can I beam him? F it. Commander I, Data, I don't get him. Yeah, let's, let's take this Mr. guy Data, on board. Lock onto Commander Tyrolak. Beam him. Yes, sir. Too late, Picard. The enemy has engaged its self destructive wow. sequence. Like what a dick! What a At dick! Least. Oh. Mr. Data, give me a scan of this sector. Yes, sir. No unusual readings. Good work. Shut <laughs> <laughs> up! Wow, I helped a lot. And then he just looks down like, hmm. like mm. Agreed. Uh, okay, comms. What do you have to report, Captain? Well, we blew a thing up. Yep. The well, relay station has been secured. Be fair, we defeated one of the warbirds, but, but unfortunately the Romulans destroyed themselves to avoid capture. The Romulans have a strange conception of honor. Well, there's no time to dwell on that. I have another assignment for you. Yeah, but we need that organic. <gasps> We're needing need some, some repairs. repairs. We're in need of some repairs. There's no time. Oof. Oh, okay. We've just received a communication from a Klingon attack cruiser in the Bela system. They reported engaging three warbirds headed for this outpost. Give the Klingons any assistance they need, and make sure those warbirds don't get through. We're on our way. Lay in a course for the ballast system. Warp, warp nine. nine. We're just zipping around yeah, right now. we are cruising. The first part of this game, we were like, eh, warp, warp five. five. Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. Engage. It's cool. On five. On fine. On I forgot that they make you do all this combat. No, I'm fine with it. I was, it was fine once I locked on. It wasn't just randomly firing yeah, a spray tor of torpedoes. torpedoes all over space. Yeah. Sure. I once understand. I realized that, mm -hmm. warp nine and we're almost there. And we're there. We're there? Also, Goldar Epsilon is where we're at. Hey, <laughs> crew of the Enterprise. <laughs> Make my Goldar and, grow. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah. Okay, so. We are receiving a message from Captain Kidra of the Bortas. The Bortus was one of the first Klingon ships to offer assistance when the Romulan invasion began. Captain Kidra fought with me against the Duras. He is a warrior of great courage. Thank good, you, good. Put him on screen. Greetings, Captain. Whoa, whoa. This is Jean-Luc Picard of the Enterprise. <laughs> His little eye thing, like... Mm. Uh, Captain Picard, it is an honor. I, I like how... Klingon, you know it's a Klingon because they have their. This is the equivalent of just having an American flag behind you when you're like talking <laughs> to anybody on a Skype call. We should have started this stream with an we American flag. Just have a big American us. flag behind us, exactly. The honor is mine. Lieutenant Worf speaks very highly of you. <laughs> As well, he should. We crushed many enemies together. God, I want to say that. When I, when I say that, when I talk good about somebody, I'm like, oh, I, they're like, oh, I know so-and-so. I'm like, oh, me too. We've crushed so many enemies together. <laughs> Wonderful guy. Well, Wonderful I bear good news, Captain. We have saved one of your communication relays from a Romulan attack. Yo. Then yes. we are in your debt. Do you require any assistance with your ship or crew? None whatsoever. We were completely unscathed. This is also an important plot point, I think. And, Captain, we captured a warbird and many Ooh. prisoners. It was a truly glorious victory. Yeah, you're doing better than us, dude. Yeah, seriously. You captured a Romulan warbird without any resistance? They had little to resist us with. When we boarded their ship, we found that it had been severely modified, stripped of most weapons and many other systems as well. Why would they purposely make themselves so vulnerable? The modifications nearly doubled their engine power. It seems they were willing to sacrifice weapons for speed. What does that mean exactly? Like, what do you mean? If we, so engine power, right? Right. We're going like, are they talking normal impulse speed? No, I think they're talking warp. But, I think because I- Doubling it from what? Because I think- Am I about to have to go look online on a Wikipedia page to find out what the warp factor of a Romulan Warbird is? We're gonna have to go to Memory Alpha, yeah. It's I'm gonna have to look that up, uh, because if you double that, is it is it one of those like math things where when I'm thinking double, we're not talking like from warp seven to warp 14, we're talking like from warp 9.5 to 9.6. Well, I think what we're talking about here is, I mean, if I had to guess, uh -huh. because you can't go faster than, 
you can't go warp 10. It's impossible. It's impossible. You can't do it. Yeah. Uh, But I think what maybe you can sustain it for longer. Look, I don't know how this all works. This all seems like yeah, like someone was paid to make a Star Wars or Star Wars, Star Wars game, Star Wars and game. it came out Star and Trek, and they just made Star Trek yeah. instead. When they start talking about the parsecs and shit, you mm-hmm. know, one that well, makes sense. Sure. My good friend Han Solo Hello. and I <laughs> played many enemies together. Chewbacca's Captain, a dick, though. Such modifications would have placed extreme stresses on the Warbird's hull. It would not have survived an extended mission. Maybe they never expected to survive. Maybe they were on a suicide mission. But a suicide mission for what? Shut up, number one. During our interrogations, the prisoners mentioned a weapon of some kind. Perhaps that is what they were seeking. Well, we have pre- Yep, kapla to you. And I had kapla to you. Yeah, we should find out more information. Yeah. Tell me about the battle, because he loves talking about the battle. Tell me about the battle. We were on patrol in the ballast system near your relay station when we detected three warbirds approaching rapidly. You engaged three warbirds with a single ship. I wouldn't care to face those odds even in the Enterprise. We were ready for an honorable death as we closed with their lead ship. We locked our disruptors, prepared to fire, and they fled. The cowards ran from us us. even though they held the advantage. They didn't even attempt to attack the station. They were concerned only with escape. By the time we disabled their first ship, the other two were already out of range. Were you able to track them? Yes, for a while. We believe they were heading for the Zatanis Nebula. What exactly did you learn from the prisoners? They spoke of an ancient weapon. A relic of a long dead race known as the Chodak. Mm, everything a weapon with that of Chodak. ultimate power Chodak. which would solve all their problems, put an end to their war, and destroy both the Federation and the Klingon Empire. How about that Chodak, though? Yeah, you sound Chodak. as if you don't believe this weapon exists. It is nothing more than a desperate fantasy. According to our reports, their empire will soon be overrun by alien invaders. The Romulans are clutching for anything they think can save them. Yo, what alien invaders, though? Assuming the weapon is real, how did the Romulans expect to find it? Apparently, they found clues to the weapon's supposed location at the site of some Chodak ruins. Now they're wasting valuable ships on a useless quest while their empire burns. Fools. Yeah, what about the Romulans' yeah. war? What's going on with this? Can you tell us anything else about the Romulans' war? They are fighting a formidable adversary. Extremely powerful aliens from the far side of their empire. We know nothing more than that. They're fighting a war on two fronts. Huh. I wonder when this... When did this game come out? Oh, gosh. Is there, like, anything question. canonical about this war that the Romulans are fighting? That's interesting. 96, maybe? Something like that? Maybe 97. You, they got me. They got me going. You gotta they got know. Going you gotta ask. I, I mean, I gotta. I gotta do this for me. This is a for me moment. Putting this right in front of the game. Uh, Star Trek map. Holy. Oh wow. Holy map, map of, of galaxy. Because galaxy? I know the quadrants. Yeah. I know how that works, but I'm hoping there's an updated one. Yeah, maybe they are talking Ooh. about more Klingon Empire. Ooh, Lord Almighty. So, God. All right. Oh, the Federation is huge. Well, yeah, well, the Federation's very, very big. Yeah, Klingon Duh. Empire. Romulan stairs. The... Oh, I didn't know the Romulan and the Klingon shared a border. That's what it looks like. So it must be on that side, on the that side up there. Yeah. So it's over here. The hell. Yeah. So uh, that's what I was curious about. I was like, okay, there's clearly a side to the Romulan Empire that isn't. Yeah. Like you know. Cardassian. Yeah, man, the Cardassian Union barf. Yeah, the Ferengi alliance. alliance, the Breen. Oh, man, look at all this. This is crazy, guys. Look up a uh, Star Trek map of the galaxy, and you'll get some stuff on here. Some interesting information you might is not. Is this have the known. canonical map of the galaxy? I don't know. It looks well because there's many different serious. This one says serious, comprehensive Star Trek map of the galaxy. Yeah. Oh, but this is, is, this this Pinterest. is Pinterest. I have oh, to log into F that. Ugh. Logging in is for suckers. Um, so this is the this is the Milky Way Gal- Galaxy Quadrant list. Mm-hmm. So Delta Quadrant is the Voyager series. Mm-hmm. And most of Star Trek takes place, I assume, in 
alpha and beta? Maybe? Next generation? Yeah, I think so. Could be. And then... Gamma Quadrant is some gibberish. That's, yeah. Who knows? Yeah. All right. Fascinating, That's I guess. Where, yeah, exactly. Okay, cool. Well, they're fighting something on the far side of the Yeah, that the, the, like the, the Federation would not Romulan have any knowledge. Commander mm -hmm. myself. Cool. I can beam over immediately. Why you gotta keep doing this? Yeah. I'm afraid that won't be possible. The Commander is presently... Mm, indisposed. Perhaps. I trust that you're handling them. No, I don't trust that, but whatever. I trust that you are handling the prisoners appropriately. Of course, but several of them are still alive. Oh. <laughs> okay. Captain, I'd like to respectfully <laughs> remind you that you are in Federation space, and as such, like this guy, you're expected yeah. to conform to Federation rules of conduct, including the proper treatment of prisoners. Oh, man. They have been given the proper treatment that Romulans deserve. He's dancing around this one. Perhaps it would be better for all concerned if you released the prisoners into our custody instead. This is a Klingon matter, Picard. It is none of your concern. If our methods are so distasteful to you, perhaps next time Oops. the Federation can defend itself without our help. Oh, we didn't get to say Kapla. You know what? What could the Romulans be up to? That's we fine. don't care. F that guy. It's fine. They are not eager to fight. Their actions seem somewhat desperate. I'm beginning to wonder if this really is an invasion after all. Thanks, Thanks. Troy. Yeah. Killing it. Yeah. According to the information provided by Captain Kidra, the modifications to the Warbirds will render the ships unusable within a few weeks. Hmm. That would seem inconsistent with the needs of a long-term occupational force. But they made those modifications for a reason. Speed. It looks like they're trying to get to the Zitarnus Nebula as fast as they can. <laughs> you really Agreed. enunciated that. The question is, why? Oh, <laughs> uh, Jonathan Frakes showed up on, like, a Saturday. Looks like they're trying to get to the Zitarnus, Zitarnus Nebula. Nebula. <laughs> as fast as they can. I love his reading voice. He's oh, just great. trying to get through the day, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Jonathan Frey's got shit to do. Yeah, he's got shit to do, like, tomorrow. <laughs> Oops, see? He's, he's yeah, doing whoa, a dance. Whoa. He's uh, fancy. Let's jump on the comms talk to Commander Chan. Captain, what do you have to report? The Bortas chased off the warbirds. One Klingon ship chased off three warbirds? Not only that, it disabled and captured one of them. I think I'll send Captain Kidra a bottle of Saurian brandy along with my thanks. He certainly earned it. According to his prisoners, the Romulans are not interested in invading the Federation, at least not yet. Apparently they're heading for the Zatanis Nebula. That nebula has no strategic value. What are they looking for? We believe they're seeking an ancient weapon built by the Chodak. The Chodak? I've heard the stories. Some kind of star-eating superweapon hidden in the nebula. But they're just stories. The Romulans wouldn't risk war over a myth. Or would they? But the Romulans never do anything without considering all the consequences. Perhaps there's more truth to these stories than we realized. All right, Captain. A pair of Klingon attack cruisers have just arrived in the sector to support us. I think we can manage without you. If you want to investigate this Chodak weapon further, you're free to do so. Thank you, Commander. I intend to get to the bottom of this. Sir, we are receiving a signal from Starfleet. It is Admiral Williams. Yo, Lotto. what up, Admiral? Hey, how's it going? On screen. <laughs> On screen. Just ignore that. Greetings, Admiral. What can we do for you? Captain, Commander Chan notified us of your findings. Your suspicions that this was not a full-scale invasion appear to be correct. The Romulan incursion appears to be limited to the sectors between the Neutral Zone and the Zatanis Nebula. We must find out what they're really after. Agreed. The recurring thread through all this seems to be the Chodak. Do you have any ideas where to begin? Most of the surviving Chodak ruins are in Romulan space. However, we recently discovered a new site on Phrygis. There's also a Vulcan archaeologist, Shaynok, who's an expert on the Chodak. I'll That's attempt right. to contact him as well. All right, Captain. Good luck. William's out. I like how we're just making phone calls now. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, hold on. Um. Uh, okay, so... I like to evaluate the situation, right? Yeah, we can do that. 
I should like to consider the situation a bit further. Oh, I thought we were in Kaldak. Show na Sh Shannon. Uh, we have to go to Horst. What? Any suggestions? I'm sorry, Captain. All right, astrogation. Uh, uh, how do I get to the place I need to go? Okay, so go Captain, back to the bridge. An urgent message is coming in from Chancellor Larocque. On screen. What? Captain Picard. What? A Romulan warbird has invaded our system. You promised to defend us. Please come as quickly as you can. <laughs> Set course for fridges. Aye, sir. Oh, warp eight. Okay, not quite warp nine. Engage. I like how we, I guess, got that because we didn't do anything, question mark? Could be? I, I think that's a sort of like shoot in that direction. Yeah, no, I have no clue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you, how far are we? 48 light years. We bump that, it, bump yeah. that shit up to warp no, 9. No, no, no. He can wait. Whoa. He can wait. All right. That's fair. I'm Mr. Wolf, Worf. your analysis. Captain, we should check our orders from Captain, Starfleet. I have no thoughts of my own. Yeah. Mr. Data. Data, any suggestions? I suggest we contact Starfleet, Captain. You're all thoughtless zomboids Warning. now. Entering Nebula. Uh oh, here we go. Oh boy, here we go. Entering Federation space. <laughs> oh, we're almost there. You left the nebula. Captain's log supplemental. Uh -oh. We have arrived at Phrygis in response to a distress call from Chancellor Larak. After the commercial Although break. he claims to have been mm -hmm. attacked by the Romulans, we can find no evidence that any battle ever took place. Sensors are picking up a vessel. A vessel. Yellow a alert. A Romulan warbird is on sensors. Targeting Romulan Locking warbird. Weapons. Do you need a moment, Captain? I understand you humans need to pray before death. Oh, never mind. Okay, he's... Yeah, we know. We know that. Yeah. You know as well as I Let that our know. ships are evenly matched. A fight is in nobody's best interest. I am very much interested in a fight, Captain. The destruction of the Enterprise will be a great oh, boost to my guy. career. Kill his ass. What? Hey, what? what? Ray shields. Fire. We are being hailed. What? Do you need a moment, Captain? You know as well. I am. What the? Fire. Shoot his ass. That phases. No doubt. How do I? How do I? I'm just shooting out my ass. Oh, oh my god. Admiral's log, stardate 47199.3. <laughs> we have lost contact with the Enterprise. She's several days overdue, and I fear the worst. I'm dispatching the USS Hood to investigate. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, uh, we gotta start all the way over. Oh, fuck. We that's okay. We, we, can, we, can, we can skip all the shit. Oh, fuck me. That's funny. We are being hailed. No, fuck that guy. Oh, no, no, no. Fire. We are being hailed. No, nope. fuck you, buddy. Torpedo away. We are. We are being hailed. Destroy their their. Our phaser fire missed. We are being hailed. Nope. 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 Don't listen to him. We're just gonna go straight. Oh, there we, go. Nice. we are being hailed. Torpedo locked. We like went into our first hit. Nice. We are being hailed. No damn. Ooh, no damn. Nice. fire missed. Okay. The shields are holding. Fire. Nice. Okay. We are being now. hailed. Michael Dorn, please. We're trying Torpedo to conduct away. a space. Every time that we've been hailed, this son of a bitch has shot all of our bases. Yeah. Fire. We are being hailed. Yeah. F this guy. F this guy. F we this guy. Hailed. F, F this, this guy. guy. Of this guy. guy. Okay. The get enemy the has engaged fuck out of there. Destruct sequence. Escape. Uh, escape. Escape. Are we good? I mean, that shit just happened real quickly. I think so. The Romulan warbird has been destroyed. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Condition green. Thank you, Space Jesus. I really appreciate that. I cannot begin to thank you for coming to our rescue. Yeah, you're welcome. If I can help you in any way. I'd like to beam a team down to your planet and talk with you more directly. You and your crew will be most welcome. Didn't we just deal with these guys? Yeah, but we gotta talk to them again. All right, save. Enter. I, I never oh want to do that God. again. Let us never do that again. Uh, all right. I guess we're going here. Where's the turbo lift? To the transporter. Yo, Picard's going. Yo, we got the captain. Damn. Damn. And Troy. That's true. Beam down coordinates selected. I think you gotta actually do it, dude. I have to do it? Wait, wait, click on click on the little Captain Picard icon on the left. Yes. That's right. Look, okay, these are some of your other options. Look, you can get like red Butler? shirts. Butler? Oh my god. This is probably fine though. Sure. Yeah, you gotta do it. Wow, okay. Oh, once we get the beam down coordinates. Wow, so this isn't like easy at all where I had to- like, Beam down me. coordinates mm -hmm. selected. Whoa. Yep, I know. That's pretty nice, yeah. that's pretty cute. Isn't that cool? Everyone knows you just slide your hand up and that's yep. how you do it. That's it. I gotta go as Picard. Walk right. and talk. Chancellor Larrick. And whoop. Thank you for allowing us to beam down. I welcome you in the lawgiver's name. Although the sects have refused to help, I am more than willing to assist you. The ancient Chodak have suddenly assumed great importance in galactic affairs. We were hoping you could tell us some more about them. Our people have always been fascinated by the ruins found when our ancestors arrived here. Over the years, we have learned many things about the Chodak society and technology. What do you know about Chodak technology? We do not fully understand the principles behind it, but it we've been able to make somehow. some of it function. The chameleon field that disguises our world, for example, is a Chodak invention. What else have you discovered about Chodak technology? They had an unusual way of navigating that seemed to be based on how long it took to travel between different points at a particular speed. Unfortunately, I don't know how yeah. they define you their basic units, you mean so I can't parsecs? be more specific. Yeah, parsecs or you mean parsecs? Light years? Is there anything else you can tell me about Chodak technology? They created special shielding materials which could block out any transporter beams we know of, yet their own transporters could pass through them easily. What else have you discovered about Chodak technology? They use devices similar to isolinear rods as keys to many of their machines. Here. Let me give you one. Oh, okay, thanks. How does it work? When this programmer is twisted around the rod's end, it can alter the rod's settings, making it a sort of all-purpose key. If you use the programmer properly, you can activate almost any Chodak machine or computer. Oh, there we go. Is there anything else you can tell me about Chodak technology? The crowning glory of their technology was something called the Unity device Unity that device. made it possible for them a to control their far flung empire. Unity? Do you have any more details about this Unity device? I think it was a super weapon with almost unlimited powers. When the Chodak lost it somehow, their empire fell apart almost immediately. What do you know about Chodak society? Their empire spanned this quadrant, encompassing tens of thousands of star systems. It endured for a hundred thousand years. Then, nine hundred thousand years ago, it disintegrated. Whoa. Almost over. Oh, they've been gone for a million years. Almost. It's unusual for such an immense empire to last that long. What was the secret of their success? They had a talent for administration. <laughs> they had an entire planet called Alanor, from which they ruled their at. empire. The bureaucracy must have been colossal. What else do you know about Chodak history? They loved administration. administration. <laughs> have you ever heard of logistics? <laughs> Sit we down. believe that the group be which settled <laughs> here and built these structures was not from the mainstream of Chodak society. Why do you say that? For one reason, this is a very small base. The structures the Chodak built could not have held more than a few thousand people. This could not have been a major colony. And for another? The Chodak settlers often refer to Alinor as the seat of evil, 
and frequently said that the Unity device, the Empire's chief means of control, had to be destroyed. Perhaps the settlers here were similar to your own ancestors, fleeing an established society to pursue a different vision. Perhaps. But I suspect Maybe. the Chodak Maybe. here also, played a far more active role. Up. This outpost was only inhabited for a few decades, which coincided almost exactly with the end of the Empire as a whole. These reasons are not strong grounds for believing the settlers here were rebels. Uh-huh. There are a thousand more small clues, all pointing to the same conclusion. But there is one major mystery which could resolve the question completely. Mm. What is this mystery? A century ago, our scientists found a Chodak data crystal. We believe it contains the answers we seek, but unfortunately, the crystal is extremely old and fragile. Our equipment is not sophisticated enough to read it without destroying it. Perhaps the Enterprise's computers could read your Chodak data crystal safely. Very well. I will entrust the crystal to you. All I ask is that you share whatever you discover to satisfy our own curiosity. Okay, we can okay. If you'll excuse me, I have other duties to attend to. Perhaps we can talk again later. As you wish. May the spirit of the lawgiver guide your path oh, through the stars. Away. We've done all we can here. Be we now, we, now we can do it. Picard t <laughs> He's like, oh, I respect him. If I, if I ever, if they ever Chancellor make a teleporter, Lerac whenever was most I helpful. get teleported anywhere, we now know anywhere, what the Romulans just... are seeking. <laughs> also, I like that we've done all we can here. I talked to one guy. <laughs> yes, that's all we can do. Do you think the Romulans have really found the Unity device? We know already if they had. The device is that powerful? I'm not sure. But without it, an empire which spanned this entire section of the galaxy disintegrated overnight. What are your orders, Captain? <laughs> I just don't know. I would... Horse go, 3. I want to go to Horse 3. That's where Shaynok is. Yes. So if we're Set like, course for Horse Shaynok, 3. look at all the shit that Aye, we sir. found. He'll be like, what the Engage. fuck? Bitch, what? Because Shaynok is like... He's like all about Chodak. Well, yeah. I mean, who isn't all about Chodak? Yeah, though? yeah, yeah. yeah. Everyone about, is all about Chodak. Chodak. All about that Chodak. All about that Chodak. Woo! Ooh. Everyone's about Chodak. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm about Chodak. You're about Chodak. Yeah. Riker is clearly about. He's Chodak. He's contemplating it. He even yeah. has a little speech bubble. Mm -hmm. what? Mm. Riker, what are your thoughts on Chodak? Captain. Uh oh. The oh. ship's computer has completed its attempt to read the damaged Chodak data crystal we received from Chancellor Larak. Go on. Any success, Mr. Data? Only in part, sir. Much of the information was corrupted, as we had feared. But there is one section that may be of interest in our current situation. As Chancellor Larak guessed, Phrygis was indeed a rebel base. Mm. The crystal explains how the rebels stole information from the main computer on Alinor and used it to attack the Unity device itself. The Rebels used a programmable encryption rod to access Alinor's main computer and learn vital information about the Unity device. Oh. This information was then used to plan a raid against the Unity device. There is then a corrupted section and a brief mention of a space freighter called the Rinkel. I am not certain what the connection is between the freighter and the raid. Okay. The complete text of the information may of course be found in the ship's computer. Um, can you, can you beep, uh, Chancellor of the Rock? Primary core access enabled. Hold, Systems hold online. Your okay, okay. Hold your butt. Okay, I'm holding. What do you, what do you look for? Data Chris. There we go. Um, this is like... Corrupted for over the millennia, for oh, wow. assault, the unity device, I believe in the attack. We used the programmable encryption, which we just heard about. Final attack will commence at blank. We'll intercept the space liner Wrinkle. Stable engines, jam communications, the Grints. Terrible name. You stole Christmas. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> the Grints that stole Unity. Yeah, the Grints that stole Unity. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All the wrinkles in Wrinkle Veil. <laughs> Asleep in their beds. This is my favorite. Once we have control of the Unity device, we will use its power to data corrupt it. 
into the future and out of reach of the meddling bureaucrats once and for all. End of file. End of, yeah. Okay. Oh, we can't. Never mind. We're almost there. Yeah, we're almost to horse three. Worf? Mr. Wolf, your analysis. I think we just got to Starfleet. Talk to Starfleet. Captain. We yeah. should check our orders from Starfleet. We should right, what talk if we to went Starfleet. Starfleet? The ancient Chodak oh. race seems to be at the heart of the current situation. The Vulcan scholar Shane. Way I'm ahead of aware. you. Way ahead of you, dates. I think it's more than coincidence that references to the Chodok keep appearing everywhere we you look. You guys are useless. Can you fucking say it right? What happened to everyone else? Are picking in here? up a vessel. He said what? Chodok. What? Whoa. Uh. Intercept the target. Intercept the target. Helm, plot an inter. What is the vessel? What, what is the vessel? Go to a Romulan warbird is on sensor. What? what? Are you Locking serious? Weapons. No. Oh. Following. Suit engage. Oh, wait, I'm getting shields out. We definitely do. Are you serious? They want you to get your money out of the space combat. Yeah, I guess so. They programmed it. We may as well do it more than twice. Yeah. We haven't done it much at all this entire... I think we can right, This guy's him. effed up, though. This guy sucks. Oh, yeah. That first commander was way stronger. This guy's commander like... Yeah, he's a chump. Commander Dingleberry. He's not very good. <laughs> commander Dingleberry. That's a, it's, a, it's a Romulan name. Yeah. Now, how is his... Both of his engines so effed up? What are these, Elvin? They cells or whatever. Come on. There we go. We have any more torpedoes left? I have to, right? There's little shits firing out of me, I think. There's little shits firing out of me, I think. I think, I think. Maybe, maybe. Do you need a moment, Captain? Oh, right. The crew of the Enterprise has always been willing to. What the? Oh, I don't have any more front facing. Uh, maybe that's what it is. Torpedoes! Photon tubes are empty. Oh, alright, what phasers it is! Can you beat anyone without? Why would we stand there being fired on like that, you big goobers? Uh, maybe we can. Um, how do you win a, like a battle like this? Maybe you just have to evasive maneuvers and run away. Buy more photon torpedoes. How do we buy torpedoes? <laughs> I don't know. To Salvo. I guess you had to be like five and five, so Wait it doesn't. A minute. See that photon torpedo spread? Yeah. Make it small. And then maybe torpedo next spread time. maximum. Maybe we do like a really small spread, and then when they're in front of us, just shoot a small spread, so it's like a, it's like a really focused blast. Get everything up. Yeah. Enemy ship is firing. Damage to the sensor array. What? It's fascinating to look at. Yeah. I mean, it, it seems very, uh, it's, uh scientific. Maybe? I wish... Our phaser fire missed. Fire. No Robot damn. <laughs> Our phaser fire missed. Getting them in our 
like direct line of sight and then just on moves away. are empty. Yeah, we have no torpedoes left. Completely filled now. Enemy ship is firing. Our phaser fire missed. Fire. We are completely and totally fine too. How does this fight end? Fire. Rock. Robot rock. Set up. Set up. Uh, wharf to deal with the weapons for a minute. Mr. Wolf, you have tactics. And then go to engineering. Captain, I am honored. Locking I weapons. Can, I think there's certain things we can repair. Yeah, like check shields. Fire. Shields are fine. They're all fine. Sensors? I think they said sensors was damaged. Everything's fine. Other? Targeting Romulan Warbird. Oh. Everything is totally fine right now. Total power. Repair. Yeah, we're like doing great. We just don't have any weapons anymore. Because the Admiral was just like, no, we don't have any time for weapons. Yeah, estimated repair time and all this stuff. There's no, you know, it's 100% operational. What the fuck? Everything's fine. We have been hit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're like good still. Enemy ship is firing. No damage. The shields are holding. No damage. What are we gonna do? What are we doing, pal? Hopefully shoot them with the face. Fire. Fire. Targeting Romulan Warbird. What is happening right now? The target is out of range. Oh, are they running? They must be. There is no response to our hail. High pursuit. Oh, wow, we just didn't about face. Charge after every shot, so you might be shooting ones that are out of power. No damage. The shields are holding. At this point, I'm like, do they have any? Do they have Fire. any power? We don't know. Fire. Fire. Spectrum Halibite, I really appreciate your uh, attempts to recreate accurate starship combat, but really. Fire. This. This is gonna go on forever. How do you do anything? Fire. He's literally not taking damage. Fire. But I don't think we are either. Can we just peace out? Fire. Just run. Our phaser fire. fire missed. Well, that's on you, Mr. Moore. Yeah, that's your literal only job right now. Fire. And we're hitting with all the charged phasers, but... Fire. 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 Power. Fire. 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 Come on now. Fire. Our phaser fire missed. Fire. I can't believe this is still happening. If this is what space combat is going to be like in the future, count me out. I just want to be a, I want to be a, a galactic merchant. Fine. Don't just shoot torpedoes. You need to lower their shields with your phasers. That's literally what we're doing. Their shields aren't lowering. Fine. Fine. Our phaser fire missed. 
Oh, I suppose that is true that we didn't restock after we saved the base. I didn't know you had to restock. That was never like a thing that I knew from this game. Yeah, I mean, I, I never explained it. I didn't either. And they don't really, they have the option for like, there's no time. You have to go. Yeah, I was like, hey, can we, these can we resupply? Like, no, go deal Fine. with the Romulus right now. Yeah. Fire. 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 <laughs> We're both just twisting around in space, trying to shoot each other. How is he? Fire. Photon tubes are empty. You know what? There is no response they to our hail. Let's just leave. Let's just fucking leave. Fire. Enemy ship is firing. Our phaser fire missed. Fire. Bye, hater. The target is out of range. Bye. Piecing out backwards, we're piecing out backwards. Well, like look at look at the look at the map, right? I think we're. I, I think see. We, I see what we're doing, but like we might actually be piecing out backwards. We're piecing out backwards, and he's catching up. Fine. I love how he's chasing us. He's like rolling at us. What is happening? Is what is happening? Fine. The story gets better. The target is out of range. You just have to deal with this bad combat. You were right. When we first started, you were like, the combat in this game is pretty jank. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it definitely is. Yes. This is 100% is very truly jank. an unbearable combat experience. Yes. Like, I don't know what. I've never experienced a game where I can't tell you what I'm supposed <laughs> to be doing while fighting. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. I think, I think the reason that it's so janky is because the positioning is so weird. Because they really tried to do a three-dimensional combat, but it looks like we're on a two-dimensional. Well, like, how do I? What do I do now? Enemy ship is firing. I mean, we're just we're out of there. We're out of five bounty. Out of where? Where are we going? I well, can't like, go to the bridge. I mean, you can sort of see our position relative to They're the other ship. They're slowly firing torpedoes. He's off our grid. Yeah, I mean, he's off the grid. So what do we do? We just keep running. To where? Away from the ship. But like. There is no response to our hail. No. Acknowledged. No. Hear me out. No. Hear me out. No. Hear me out. Fifteen seconds to auto destruct. Hang on. Hear me out. Ten seconds to auto destruct. What are you doing? Five seconds to auto destruct. What are you doing? What are you doing? Just kidding. Okay. Acknowledged. I thought maybe auto that would make him run away. Be like, whoa, this guy's crazy. We gotta get out of here. Get us out of here. We warped away. Did okay. we? Oh, yes. nice. Wait, let's go back to that star base. Let's go back to the star sure, base and yeah. be like, give us some fucking shit. Someone torpedoes. give us some fucking shit. Yeah. We don't even know where we're going. Enemy ship is firing. Are you serious? Oh, no! They followed us! We don't have enough power. To warp away? Warp engines unable to sustain oh. current speed. Okay. Reducing speed to maximum warp. Let's go to that outpost. Let's, let's go to the let's go to the outpost. Cause you sure. can you can see our previous destinations there. Com relay. Or out, out, outpost 543. Here? Yeah, let's fucking cruise on over there. Warp engines unable to sustain current speed. Sure. Reducing speed to maximum warp. Sure. 4.7. Yeah, okay. Engage. Let's get let's go. Let's get out of there. Let's just be as Meanwhile, Shinnok dead. Yeah. Shinnok died. But you see, that's fine. Yeah. Because I didn't even like that dude. No, no, no. He sucked. Yeah, I didn't even like that guy. Hey! Anyone in Starfleet? Anyone wanna Admiral do your Williams damn here. jobs? <laughs> <laughs> no, but they could give us a performance review. Are you That's not what me? we need. We need torpedoes. Pick out. I need torpedoes. 
Where do I get torpedoes from? Apparently, let's hope that this outpost can do something for Wasn't us. Wasn't this the outpost that was, like, damaged, though? No, this one was protected. Uh, let's hail them? Maybe use our... <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Go to a starbase. This, this is what people are okay. saying. Display. See info. Here we go. Call call Sir, we are receiving a sick on screen. Oh. Greetings, Admiral. An unknown alien race has just crossed the neutral zone into Federation space. What? All attempts to commu- Are they hostile? Definitely. So far, every ship and outpost in their path has been attacked, disabled, and left for dead. Do we have any idea of their objectives? That's the strangest part. It looks like they're pursuing the Romulan fleet into the Zatanna's Nebula. Uh-oh. Then my first instinct will be to let them go with our blessings. I wish we could. Unfortunately, outpost Delta-08 lies directly on their present course. We can't afford to lose we it. We literally Proceed cannot go. Proceed at best possible speed we to cannot the Yars go. system. Understood. No. What are your orders, Captain? Set course for the- No! <laughs> no! Engage. No! No! Oh, we can't take on an even worse foe! <laughs> this is impossible. This is no. Okay. No. Can you change our course to a star base? We have to- okay. We have to be able to change course, right? Go to this. Right? Okay. Go to- Go to display, right? Okay, yeah, yeah. Inhabitants bay- Inhab star bases displayed. Yeah, disable everything that isn't neutral zone not displayed. Alien vessel left. Relic. Hail. No! There is no response. No! It is a new... no! <laughs> Targeting air. Decloaking. No, come on. They're, they are, oh, wow. On after the right now. Oh my god, we okay. just got wrecked so badly. So I think what we're gonna have to do is reload, go to a star base. Look at this fucking space tea bag! Wow. That's not even cool. Okay, so load, immediately go to computer, mm -hmm. which is up by wharf, or data. Sorry. Go to. No, 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 no. All right. Okay. Display. Neutral zone, not star, star bases, bases displayed. So the star Where's star bases? I don't see any. Uh. How would I find a star base? Somebody was saying that you can literally, um, Go to the computer and there's pre-built starbase destinations in there. Primary there core access enabled. Uh, Systems online. Yeah, destinations. Starbases. Cool. Uh, look at it in sector 131. So then go to... Okay, Engage. So, yeah. There we go. <laughs> this is so wild. This is so wild. Warning, entering Nebula. Entering Nebula. Oh my god, I really hope we can make it there before we get the message being like, hey, Yo, someone's in trouble. I don't give a shit what they say. Yeah. We need everything. Uh, we would like to consider the situation a bit further. Yeah, we need literally every, like, we need miscals and torpedoes. And, and phasers. And phasers. Can you, put, Federation space. can you put more phasers on? You can put phasers on phasers, man. Yeah, exactly. Hail the starbait. Hailing the star. Cleared for docking. Take us in, number one. Oh, thank God. Do you think we can get, like, upgrades? I don't think I've ever done this in the game. Maybe. I'll trade you this Chodak relic. Starbase, everybody's like, whoa, it's the Enterprise.
eyes. Yeah, they're Holy like, damn, shit. that's the biggest dick in the galaxy. Yeah, okay, use your communicate. Uh, Admiral William. Um, oh, never mind. The god out. Is that it? Maybe check engineering and see if... Or tactical? See if our torpedo tubes are reloaded. Check the technical computer. We go to torpedoes. Oh, I think we're reloaded. What the, how do we know how many we have total? That's a good question. How do we know what a reloaded torpedo tube looks like? We, we just start attacking the star base. Wait, why is our power going down? What? What? Oh, because we're powering down weapons. But, like... How do I know... How do... 259 torps total? Where did how'd... you see that? Was that in engineering? It must have been. Go to weapons. Yeah, total down there. Oh, thank there God. we go. Okay. okay, okay. We good. We we're good, good now. We're Gucci. All right. All right. So we need to go. Where do we have to go again? What are we doing? So we went to Frigis. We got the the crystal. And Shenok is where we. Had yeah, to go. we got to go to Horse Three. So we got to go down and find Horse Three. There it is. Now let's fucking zip over there. Engage. Right out of the star yeah, dock. We should, we should make a new thing. Data. Yeah. Alright. Save. We're gonna save it as. Torps. Torps. Torps 259. 259. Nice. Okay, we're good. We're good. So now we're going to Horst. While we're on this little joyride. All these fools want us to make it harder. I. Yeah. I. Man, I do forget, not like it harder. Forget that. I don't like it hard. Nope. Mm -mm. Big old softy. Big old yeah. We're pro. give him the give me the old softy. Yeah, I don't want it hard. We want I want it softy. soft serve. Mm -mm. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. None of that. None of that. Uh, old Sensors are picking style. up a yeah. vessel. Uh oh. Here we go. Here we go. What's up, Worf? Uh, intercept the target. Intercept the target. Helm. Okay. What I would suggest. Oh wait, no. I said it wasn't the next. A Romulan warbird is on sensors. Do you think? All right, following pursuit. We who are about to die. Uh, Did we just like? Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? Yo, how do we do that? Uh, I guess that's what happens when you make the missile spread all in a row, all straight ahead, and then this, that's dumb. <laughs> wait, 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 go to torpedoes. Yeah, spread. Ne next spread, time, spread. next time, no, I want to just shoot them in a straight line. <laughs> Full stop. Oh, it's so oh, dumb. Okay. We fit it. We did it. Are we? We're almost at horse. Wait, that is just a guy who was along the way. He yeah. pulled us out of hyperspace? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hell, How? Standard orbit. What do you mean we can't... Can we... Transporter. Shannon. There are no valid beam down coordinates We can't beam down to Shannon. Well, they didn't draw the background, so we can't. So do we not... Go to, go to view screen, maybe? Oh. Can we not reach Shannon? Is it because we didn't get the... The comms thing? Maybe talk to Data? Mr. Data, and I suggest we. Can you fucking. Admiral Will. I'd like. Of course. Your orders are to. What? I'm please, Captain Kedro. Shall I go? No, thank you. Oh my god. What? The Romulan invasion has been reclassified. The card out. What? We must have to wait until she hits us up and is like, an unknown alien species is in the 
fucking Borg or whatever. He's in the Borg? Yeah. Damn. Okay. We're there. Here we are. What if we go to... Because we already did the thing on fridges, right? It's true. I don't know what we should be looking for. Counselor, do you... I'm sorry. <sighs> Mr. War. Captain. <laughs> Captain. And is... I'm sorry. You're all you... The room is... At We're at horse three, but we can't contact Shayna. Because... Because we went to a different place? May we go back to... Fridges? Sure. Let's try it. It couldn't hurt. Yeah. Oh! Engage. Did we do that thing where Data was like... Did we do that thing with Data where he was like... Look at the crystal. Nah, 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 nah. And they said that there was it was a rebel planet or whatever the fuck. I don't know. I think we did. Guinan were here, she could tell us. Yeah, seriously. Whoopi, where are you? Whoopi, where are you at? I'd play this game with Whoopi Goldberg. Right. Just see what her reaction would be. Yeah. I bet she has some crazy stories about on set. About being on set in ten four. I made love to Jonathan Helm. Frakes. Standard orbit. I'd be like, I bet you did one. Yeah. I bet everybody made I bet everybody I bet, I bet got with Jonathan Frakes. I bet uh, Patrick Stewart. Damn it. Okay. We could actually go down and talk to... Uh, do you think because we didn't do this before? We might have not done it. Was the save before this? It might have been. But that's Beam okay. Then we're okay. Selected. This, then this is perfect. What? Yeah, we just fast forward through this. Yeah. And we've already refueled. Yeah. Go, Picard, go. Now, so Troy, you're Troy. no Picard. I welcome. Oh my god, we didn't, it didn't, we didn't do it before we had this whole conversation. Yeah. What? 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 We've what? done all. Let's get out of here. Gotcha, okay. Chancellor, Lord. Do you think we know the div I'm not. Okay, so now. What are your Let's go to Horst. Yeah. Set I sir. And game. And if Engage. anybody tries to fucks with us, we got him. Put that we got him. We got him. Laser beam. We thin. got him. Save this shit. Call it. We got him. Enter. We got him. We got him. We do got him though. We got them. We got him. We, we got. We got him. We got him. The ancient Chodak. I think it's. Thanks, dates. Chancellor. I like how he looked down because he was sad that I Mr. Like, Wall, stopped Captain. talking to him. <laughs> Starfleet. Don't care. Uh, we can bump up the speed, we, maybe? We've gone back and forth to horse up. Captain. Bunch. Oh, here we go. The ship's. Com yeah, and okay. As ch the rebel, there is uh -huh. that. The complete. Uh huh. Yeah. So we're like, we should go talk to. What's his name? Yeah. And no one's stopping us right now. Maybe because we blew him up? Question mark? Could be. I think. The Romulan battles with the Warbirds are just at every so often interval, so we took care of it early. Right. And That's now what I'm hoping for. we don't have to worry about it, maybe. That's what I'm hoping for. We blew his ass out of space. <laughs> the card face is great. Cross my heart, hope to Picard. Entering the Quasim sector. We're almost there. Entering the Toth Sector. Helm, standard orbit. Ooh, okay. let's see. Here we go. So now we did Captain Clark, we have arrived at Horse 3 to request some advice from the noted Vulcan archaeologist, Shaynok. Instead, all we have found here is a recorded message boy broadcasting continuously. Boy. <laughs> recorded message boy. boy. Hello, recorder message. To whoever hears uh -oh. this message. Uh -oh. What? He's the so sudden detailed. incursion into this region of space by a flotilla of Romulan warships has made this remote expedition untenable. For the safety of my crew, I have decided to abandon this site temporarily. 
In the name of science, I ask that you do not disturb my work on this planet. <laughs> oh, we There is will. one site that requires... The Chodak site seems to have a field that camouflages it to normal sensors. I located it mostly by accident. There is a platform jutting out part way down a deep shaft in the ground. Further investigation has been blocked by an ancient rock slide. As much as I would like to honor Shaynok's request to leave the site alone, we don't have that luxury. I told him yeah. I'd check the it out earlier, so I'm going to. Picard that we gets learn what Picard where wants. this planet mm -hmm. Alanor is. This Chodak base may have the information we need. We should form an away team at once to investigate this shaft that Shaynok spoke of. Investigate that we'll shaft. Investigate Shaynok's shaft. We'll have to be Shaynok's careful to disturb as little on the site as possible. Riker, go down there. Get down on it. <laughs> Alright, I will. This is it. This is it. What happened to all of our stuff that we, like, got? I guess we don't have that Beam anymore. down coordinates selected. All right. Oh, no. We can we actually... Now. now we can actually change the team around. Do we want to, though? I mean, it's up to... This is up to you. We should probably take the data crystal. Because now we can choose what we want to take. Let's well, take the data I mean, crystal. this is... Okay. And a med tricorder. I don't know we need to, right? Eh, probably not. All right. Let's do this. <gasps> what? Here we go. I like how they're letting me take the card now. That's fun. I probably should scan with data, but... I wonder if there could be anything behind this pile of rubble. Let's shoot it with a phaser. Yeah. Hit it with a really tough one. Yeah, blow the shit up. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. We just We use our shit. weapons pure. purely for defense or on uh, moderate stuff. Yeah, mm -hmm. like big old walk to spires. Look at spires. Look at spires. Those spires are fascinating. I wonder whether they're natural or whether the Chodak sculpted them that way. This chasm extends as far down as I can see. It looks as though there might be more to see down this. All right. <laughs> imagine, imagine walking into an archaeologist's dig site Whoa. and then just pulling out a gun and being like, <laughs> shooting part of it. It's like, oh, you couldn't get into that ancient ruin, but now you can. This can't. large piece of machinery is still functioning. Chodak rule. It did not work. Look, a shooting star. On Earth, that means you get to make a wish. Well, how do you know that? Is it shooting wish? star is actually a misnomer. In reality, they are simply meteors which are incinerated as they enter a planet's atmosphere. Data. I know data, and rainbows are just the refraction of light by water droplets. But they're still beautiful. You guys are the biggest space goobers. Oh my god. New screen. Interesting. It did not work. Look at. The Chodak must have used this screen to dis. Uh, use. This. I cannot use. Looks like there's a indentation. I cannot use. On the right side? I cannot use. Use the rod? Maybe? Good call. And then we gotta use the thingy. This, right? Yeah. Ooh, scan that shit. That's important. Scan with the tricorder. It did not work. Even though some of the data has been corrupted over time, our computer can probably deduce a wealth of helpful information from it. Yeah. Get that rod back. Take that rod out. Even though some of Okay. I got it. that, I guess. Cool. I guess we got some useful information. Yeah. Can I walk away? Use, Use exit. exit. Done. Um, Is there anywhere else to walk? Use rear it of sight. Work. We can walk. walk to rear of sight. Whoa. The hell? Oh, it's like some sort of laser beam. This looks like a device for analyzing and recording astronomical observations. Sure. It sure does, Picard. I'm going to This is the that. energy source that keeps the site running. 
that it? Huh? Maybe use? It did not work. For some reason, this was used to keep its instrument constantly pointed at one specific... Pit. <laughs> don't don't go it with did not work. please. Okay, thank you. It did not Maybe scan the instrument? If I were to speculate, I would say that this particular That would explain why this outpost is so far from the main body of the Chodak Empire. Perhaps they were attempting to make clean observations, uncontaminated by interference from their own transmissions. Let's record as much as we can. Our computer can analyze the data and make sense out of it later. Data. I cannot use this. I cannot use. Can I walk to the pit? Hmm. I don't think there's anywhere else to go. Maybe. Yeah. Walk to instrument mounting. Oh yeah, we scanned that. There's a lot of scientific. This must be the heart of the station. We must be especially careful to examine everything we find in detail. It did not work. Usually when they say that, they want you to scan everything. So you scan the instrument. For some reason, this was used to keep... Scan the instrument. This is a highly advanced subspace phase spectrometer. I understand it's used by astronomers to measure the interval between certain subspace fluctuations. Huh. Okay. This cap... That's a pit. <laughs> Yes, that is a pit. It did not work. Hmm, so what do I... Is there anything else to... I cannot use... Is there any... Uh, is there any other place to go? I mean, you can just shoot the thing with the phaser. It's a very Kirk maneuver. I don't... Like whatever this instrument is. Look at the platform. This platform dates back to the Chodak Empire. What an interesting platform. Yeah. I mean, usually we get like a, we've done the mission, so we can leave kind of thing. I think that's only on instant difficulty. I think you have to actually manually leave when you're on lieutenant. Are you kidding me? I could be wrong, though. All right. Jordy, what do your, what do your eagle eyes see? Let's put up the computer again. You can use the crystal or something. I'd like to get this information into. I can't make it. I can't make. I guess not. Maybe they literally just want you to go back to the ship and put the data on the computer. It could be that simple, maybe. I don't know. But that would be a lot of effort for making this whole like section if you. How do I beam out? Uh, you have to go to the first screen and then tap the, the communicator, I believe. Okay. Beam us up. Da thanks, Troy. <laughs> she gotta do something. Yeah, that's true. <clears throat> Captain's log. The archaeological site on Horst remains a fascinating mystery. I'm hoping that our ship's computer will be able to analyze the tricorder data we discovered at the Chodak site and tell us quickly what we need to know. Okay, computer. Primary core access enabled. No. Systems yes. online. I can't believe they wrote all of this. Look at all this lore. Data. Mr. Data, any I suggest we contact You always think we should contact Star Admiral Fleet. Will How's it going? What is the co The Romulan incursion is all but over. We think they may be after a legendary Yeah, no, we all know that. Yeah, we're here at one Got of up. the computers. <laughs> Riker just walks over like, oh, I'm useless. <laughs> it's like, shields up, red alert. No, no. Counselor, do you I'm sorry, Captain. Mr. Data, any 
I suggest I'm just waiting for the computer. Sir, we are receiving uh, on screen. Uh, Greetings, Admiral. An unknown no, alien. Yeah, yeah, okay. There we go. No, we All right. Go That's then my I wish we'd understand. So All get, right. orders, get that narrow spread. Yeah. Blow them Set the fuck course up. for the yard. Let's go Engage. to the yard. 9.2. Take us away. Oh wow, are we going 9.2? Hell yeah. We are cruising. We gotta get there. Shit yeah. is going down. Yeah. Unknown alien race. And we've encountered a lot of alien races. Go to red alert. Change my spread. Yeah. Torpedoes. Only like ten degrees. Like five, ten five degrees when they move. Yeah, yeah. Phasers. Yeah, we good. We good. We good. We good. We good. Engage. 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 Yes, to the finest crew. Unidentified it's alien stopping. vessel ahead. Here we they go. Red alert. Hail them. There is no response. Evasive maneuver. Kill the ass. Locking weapons. Wait, sure the the area. Torpedo the away. <laughs> Torpedo locked. Tactics. Oh my god. Uh, all the maneuvers. We are getting shredded. Engage. Yep. Yeah, yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Targeting area. Where are they at? Are they? Woo, we're getting hit by all sorts of shit. How am I supposed to hit them? Well, how am I supposed to hit them? Where are they? I have been hit. Our shields have failed. Um. Uh. This is stupid. This is stupid. Damage to the sensor array. What if we just ran? Let's give you enough time to like, shit. like you don't have time to do anything before you're like destroyed. Mm -hmm. That's terrible. Yeah, are we piecing out? Enemy ship is firing. The target is out of range. Yeah, that's good. Man. We have been hit. The shields are holding. Engage tactical maneuver. No damage. damage to the sensor. At least the saucer section split off. That's cool. Yeah, that's where all the important shit is. Yeah, no one cares about the rest of it. Yeah, exactly. That's so Admiral's dumb. Log. What the fuck? Uh. We got him. That's so dumb. Yeah, this is on our way to horse three. Okay, so all we have to do. I mean, I don't even. I don't, don't want to deal with. I don't. I don't give a fuck anymore. I don't, I don't, I don't, deal I don't give with, zero fucks about yeah, any of that anymore. I don't want to deal with the combat. Oh, Captain. Terrible. And he's only in part, sir. As Chancellor Larac guessed, Frigis yeah, was he's the rebel. There is the complete. Yep, we know that. Okay. While we scan, while we do the stupid computer shit again, I'll be right back. One second. Primary core access enabled. This is gonna be the same thing, Systems right? Systems online. I think so. Yeah, it's just gonna. We just gotta go down to the planet, scan the computer, and then come back out. Oof! This, that was rough. That's not fun at all. Oh, man. And nut granola mix. Trail, uh, yeah, trail you deserve bar. that fruit and nut granola mix. You know mix. what? With all the archaeology we've been doing, I've worked up quite the appetite. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You've earned it. Mm -hmm. you, earn, you. you earned that granola. Did I? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. We got this. Okay, so this is the cutscene. Helm. <laughs> to whoever he. <laughs> Picard turns around, he's like, excuse as much as me. Sorry, this shit. Oh! Beam down coordinates selected. But we uncle for Google Friend now. Do not care. 
<laughs> do not care. At this point. Uh, O'Brien's got to do something. I can't do all the damn work. That's true. in the other room. Oh, I guess not. You're right. Because that they're like, it's pointed in a certain position. This is a highly advanced... For some... This cat... This... This struck... This is... I have... I can... This device is similar to a subspace phase... I believe this structure is dis This instrument is set to measure the interval. Maybe George. Knowing where this instrument. Once we know where the Chodak were pointing this mounting, we can figure out what they were looking at. The device was set up to measure the time between certain subspace pulses. If I that would explain why this outpost is so far. Okay, yeah, we saw that. There's a lot of scientific. This must be the heart of the Troy. This is your moment. This is your moment to shine. I'm not sure what to make of these readings. God damn it! <laughs> this mounting is fixed. They made us bring you. This chasm. Diana. That's not. That's not. I do not believe. I do not believe. It didn't. It didn't. Come on. There's so little to do. I, like, that's what's confusing to me about this. Is... This device generates the chameleon field that disguises the station when you look at it from space. No. Like, this is what confuses I can't me about make... the game, is like... They don't... It didn't... Really tell you when it's... Usually they'll tell you when it's done. They'll be like, we've done everything we can. Right? But you... Be mis... Back to the I do think we have to wait until the computer analyzes that data. I think that's the next Captain's big log. step. Captain's log. Yeah. All right. Because we got that. So then we just sit here and wait for her to be like, Captain, we need you in the Gorblocky sector. Uh-huh. Watch out. There's this ship that's going to kill you. Watch out, Captain. We got him. Uh, yeah. Enter. Yeah, we got it. Set call. Go to Yaj at 9.2. Okay. All right, once more into the breach. This is, I think this is close to the end of the combat. This has to be. They can't keep making us this. This has to be the easy version. Right? I hope so. This can't be, this can't be hard now. Right? Right. This has to be easy. Yeah. Right? I mean, what is it going to be? What would it be like on Captain Difficulty? Unidentified alien vessel ahead. Red alert. Hail them. They're I genuinely don't know how. Man, <laughs> <laughs> they just stand in the shoot them. Our phasers, where are our phasers? I think they're shooting. What? There it is. Yeah, that's the other, that's the ship. I mean, sure. Please. Oh, Worf, you big goober. 
Yeah, we can do this one. Don't worry. I feel like we're not shooting at anything. The enemy has engaged its self-destruct sequence. Oh god, get out of there. Torpedo has reacquired the target. Yeah, we don't want to get when it blows up. Oh my god, we were too close! Admiral's log, stardate 47199. We were too close. How is that possible? We were too close. I w said escape. What? Everything in this game is so slow compared to, like. <sighs> we, were, we were too close. We were too close to the ship. We were right there. Sir, on screen. Engage. <laughs> I can't even right now. I can't even right now. Okay. Instead of doing a chase maneuver, which I think is to pursue escaping vessels, try a weapons maneuver instead. Sure. Okay. Which I believe keeps us at, like, tactical range. Sure. Unidentified... slow back then. It was actually the 90s. This stuff was moderately faster. Only moderately though. Right, she's going down. She's going down. I feel like this is the most ludicrous tactics. Strafe! Itself now? The enemy has engaged its self destructive Get the hell sequence. Out of there. Your shields are failing. Fine. Okay. We find. Okay, so now where's the next thing? They're both gone. Mr. Data, check the ship's computer for any possible identification of these aliens. We have no record of contact prior to these attacks. There have been rumors of a war between the Romulans and an unknown race on the other side of Romulan space. Perhaps these are the same aliens. I want to know why we had so little warning before the alien vessels attack. We did not detect them on our sensors until they were already within visual range. Did they have a cloaking device? During the battle, our sensors registered emissions similar to those of the alien probe that attacked mm. Merton's stations and the planetary shield it protecting exactly, bridges. It literally looked exactly, exactly like it, like just a bigger version. Yeah. A chameleon field? That appears to be the case. Perhaps these aliens were also responsible for the attack on Merton's station. The chameleon field is an ancient Chodak technology. These aliens might have borrowed it from them. That would explain their attack on the station. No, it's the they Chodak. The they're Chodak back. Artifacts. The Chodak are back after millions of years. They're back and they're ready for their weapon. You think it's a Chodak attack? I think it's a Chodak attack. Wow. I think the Chodak are back, back. on the, the Chodak. Atta on the Chodak. <laughs> the Chodak. I love it. Are cho back I love it. On the Chodak. Mm -hmm. Good. It's true. Mr. Data, plot the course of the alien vessels based on their attacks in this. The pattern of their attacks would indicate that they are headed for the Zatanis Nebula. Everyone knows that. Nebula. Everybody's going towards the Zatanis Then it appears Nebula. that the Romulans aren't the only race seeking the Unity device. 
Helm, so, standard orbit. So do we go there then? Uh. I mean, is that the? I swear to God, if we have to fucking contact the Starfleet again. Shit. Admiral Williams here. I of course, your orders are to invest. What's your? I was relieved to hear that the Enterprise successfully defended Outpost Delta. Z right, Shall right, I go right. on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, thank you. Okay. So I think we have to go to this Picada. nebula. I have correlated the oh. ancient Chodak there star chart with our own astrogation charts. Does it reveal the location of the Unity device? I can find no mention of the device. However, the chart does... If Alanor was the administrative center of the Chodak Empire, there we go. isn't there a chance some trace of the Chodak remain? That sounds like a long shot. It might be the only one we've got, number one. Where is Alanor? The planet is located inside the neutral zone. I don't think we need to worry about the treaty at this point. Still, we must use caution. There is a provision of the treaty which allows for scientific research. <laughs> we'll use Good that as a cover tape. for our mission. Mr. Wolf, inform Starfleet. Aye, sir. Lay in a course for Alanor. Warp f Warp five. Literally, this the galaxy is, is burning right now. And they're going, they are meandering over town. We'll get there eventually, number uh -huh. one. It'll be fine. Now, yeah. let's go spend three episodes in the holodeck. <laughs> I've got another mystery to solve. <laughs> it is 104. F this. I look, I look great in that hat. He does look good in that hat, though. Like, honestly. Oh, dicks. Let's do impulse speed. Engage. You arrive 12 million years yes, too late. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone you know and love has been dead for millennia. For millennia. Warning. Warning. Entering the neutral zone. Captain, uh -oh. I've been studying our records of one of the Chodak devices we found on Horse 3. It appears to have been designed to measure the period of a pulsar for use as a standard of time. Translating Chodak time units would be a major breakthrough. It will give us a better understanding of Chodak science. Unfortunately, the Zatarnus Nebula has expanded since the Chodak abandoned the station. The nebula now completely obscures the pulsar. The nebula grew that quickly? The Zatarnus Nebula is one of the youngest celestial bodies Whoa. in the galaxy. Are there observations of a pulsar in that region of space? None in Federation records, but the Chodak star chart does contain a pulsar at the proper coordinates. Can we observe the pulsar ourselves? The pulsar is on the far side of the nebula. It cannot be observed from anywhere uh -oh. within Federation space. Does it have a name? We should be sure a science vessel is sent to observe it. The Chodak chart refers to it as the Gambara Pulsar. It lies in unexplored space near the Romulan border. Mm. Interesting. Okay, mm. so we're we're trying to figure out what their time. Entering unit is. Federation space. Warning. Entering the neutral zone. It might help us in some wacky way. In some weird Star Trek-y yeah. way. Some sort of plot Helm, convenience. Standard way. orbit. Mm -hmm. Captain's Lord, we have arrived at the planet Alanor, where we Alan. hope to find information about the Unity device, a legendary super weapon created by the ancient Chodak. Although we've managed to travel deep into the neutral zone without being challenged, I feel certain that an encounter with the Romulans is only a matter of time. But the Chodak have been gone for hundreds of thousands of years. How could they be back? We should save them. There are no valid beam down coordinates what? at this location. We've Are there any life signs? No, sir. But we have detected an extensive network of caverns below the surface. We are picking up Cochrane field emissions from one of the chambers. Is it a natural phenomenon? I do not believe so. The field is exhibiting a binary modulation pattern, which may imply some form of computer in operation. Sounds like a good place to begin a search. Sir, many of the caverns are heavily shielded. Our comm systems and transporters will be unable to penetrate them. The nearest beam in point is more than three kilometers from the Cochrane field source. Then that will have to be close enough. I'll lead the away team myself. Captain, we have no idea what's down there. We can't- Shut up! Number one, we have no choice. Yeah, Number basically. one, the yeah. Unity device, if it exists, could be a weapon of incredibly destructive power. We must learn what it is and what it can do. My knowledge of the Chodak could be vital to the success of our mission. All right, sir. I'll assemble in a way. Make it so. Yeah, make okay. it so. We should save before we go down there. 
Sure. Just to save. Sure. We got him. Make it so. Make it so. Make it so. All right. All right, so we got Picard, Data, Jordy, and Castle Troy. Beam down no. coordinates. Who the fuck selected. is that? <laughs> Who Wait a minute. the fuck Who? is that guy? That isn't Castle Troy. Who is that? Who is that guy? Um, is that? Who is this guy? Hello? Who is this guy? And Can you locate the source of the Cochrane field the ship's <laughs> sensors detected? The Cochrane field source lies in this direction. Uh, I just hope there's enough information to allow us to find the Unity device. Um, yep. who are you? <laughs> oh boy, we get to fuck around with a, some random... It looks stuff. broken. It looks broken. I feel like I'm being watched. I feel like I'm being watched. Does he have anything... I'm not sure my tricorder is working correct. Something may be interfering with the tricorder. Okay. Who is this guy? <laughs> not much good. Not much good, I'm afraid. It looks like there's something stabbed in it. Not much good, I'm afraid. That little, like, white thing sticking out of him? What? Oh, there? Yeah. Ooh, it says foreign object. Yeah. Yeah, you pull it out. I'm not sure how it works, but it certainly oh. prevented the drone from operating. Not much good. Not much. You suck. <laughs> Shoot it with Welcome a phaser. To Eleanor. Oh. oh. Do you have anything to declare? Please note that the emergency war act is in effect. Uh oh. Anything to declare? What is it? A customs drone? The device on the derelict drone looks interesting. Uh, we can talk to it. Data, talk to it. You're a robot. The. Uh oh. Whoa. See, I didn't see what he said. Uh -oh. I didn't see what he said. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, we gave him the phaser. We gave him our phaser. We cannot proceed without phasers. We will have to. We must still deal with the cusp. We will have to dis. Not much good. Not much good. I don't think we Maybe scan him? We can't. Oh, I guess we can. Nope, this is just what's on there, so if okay. I go like this and go Maybe scan the um object? I'm not sure how it works, but it certainly prevented the drone. Not much I'd bet not. What? Look at schedule. You can learn a lot, even from- Who are you? Yeah, let's get this guy out I of here. I want a thorough search of this chamber. Get this, get this yo These remains this yo don't look 900 things. I tried to call him a yo-yo, the yo, and then I also tried to call him a yahoo. Uh -huh. So I called him a yo -hoo. I don't think this door has been opened recently. I think someone or something has you There's no exit. Look at the look at the bars maybe. It's got to be something to do with the whoa. I just don't know. The source of the Cochrane field emissions is located. I don't think we should. Well, I, I literally have no clue what to do. Uh, there's a door over there. Where? Open door on the, to the right, right there. I think we have to open door. <laughs> it's empty. Hmm. Ah! 
He collapsed when the door opened. <laughs> we'll have to return to the Enterprise for... Um... Captain, hey, what the fuck our long-range sensors are... That is the most... If we assume traveling... We can't have... Crush it to... Good. We've got to get back. Okay, let's load. Jordy, okay, Jordy what? Just fucking died. died. He opened. He. It's like. It's like the Chodak hooked up one of those things where you open the door and there's a shotgun on the other side with the string attached to. That's the... why we had the red shirt. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, he was supposed to open so the door. Yeah, who the fuck cares about this guy? Yeah. Yeah. Who cares about this guy? Okay, so take the take the. Can thingy. you locate the sword? And also, let's hear what the what he says about the, the cock field sword. If that cock. Hello. Okay, so Jordy, come over here. It emits wrong. It didn't. Try using the phaser on Welcome the bars. Welcome to Eleanor. I wonder if this. Grill isn't even warm. The importation of weapons is proscribed. Uh, I'd rather not. I'd rather. I don't think we should. Okay, so. Wait, why is it this guy now? Uh. Wait, wait, wait. For failure to comply with the instructions of. Nah, I get fucked. Wait, why? No, why are you opening the car? Why are you no! opening the car? What happened? He <laughs> collapsed when the door opened. Looks like we're going to. Yeah! <laughs> Captain, our long oh, sensors fine. are picking. He's Could it be a fine. That is the most. If we are traveling, we can't afford. Crush it to Picard. Good. We okay. Send him down. I don't know what to do. I, I have an idea. I don't know what to do here. I have an idea. Beam down coordinates selected. I have, I have a theory about what I'm supposed to do. Or what we're supposed to do. Alright. Pump that phaser up to Can maximum, you the sword? maximum fuck. Okay? The Cochrane. Alright. Phaser set to maximum fuck. And shoot that shit. The phaser had... Oh, Damn. shit. We use our weapon. We are here to... Okay. So... Have... We use our... Maybe have Data open the door? Okay, well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nothing happened. <laughs> Looks like... Is there any other door besides that? Maybe no. examine the schedule? Because we had the idiot examine it before. I believe it's an ancient... Oh, neat. Maybe data? It appears to be an... Yeah, it's a starship schedule. Oh. I think it's a starship schedule. This area must have been a standard beam in point for travel. Oh, okay. Okay, so... It didn't work. I can't pick them up, huh? can't tricorder them. I'm pretty sure these are the remains of a Romulan. Uh-oh. Okay. So... Maybe, maybe use It didn't the Mars. work. I don't think I can... Maybe Data can move it. He's hella strong, right? Yeah. Alloy I do not believe seal. that one. <gasps> Wait a minute! Shoot the shoot the alloy I seal able to move it. with the with the phaser instead of the bars. Data's a smarty, he knows. Shoot data. <laughs> okay, wait, now try the device on the derelict drone looks in. I am unable to move wait, it. Wait, I think there might be other alloy seals. You might have to shoot all of them, which would kind of be ridiculous, but it wouldn't be out of... No, out of the things we've done in this game? Yeah, that's not so bad. Okay. Let's see if there's another one. There oh, we go. All right. Okay. Now, 
I don't think that's a good idea. Now grab the device and piece the fuck out of here. Because we're going to need that to probably mess with other robots later. It emits b Okay, bye. Bye, bitch. This passage leads in the wrong direction. What? Yeah, ask me if I give a shit. Interesting. What do you think of Chodak technology, Jordy? It's a curious combination, Captain. What do you mean? Well, a lot of this stuff looks pretty dated by Federation standards. Think? Other things are so advanced, I can't even guess what they're for. That's the way we came in. Oh, that's the ventilation duct, okay. I find Chodak architecture a bit unsettling. This is what, like, I feel a planet I that find the Chodak gods would be from would look like. Yeah. I'd like to take a closer look. Ooh, hey. Hello. This looks All familiar. right, so let's do this. this. There. That should do it. Ooh, we got a screen. Whoa. System log. Oh, I'm glad that it's in English. Emergency override. Catastrophic system failure. Landing dock engaged. Transporter energize. More. Line entry F could be us accessing this panel. Mm. Okay, unauthorized. Un entry. So it knows we're here. Yeah. Sentry disabled. The unscheduled arrival at line D is probably our arrival. Yeah, that's us. Exactly. Then Sentry AA3-G must be that derelict drone. Let's go back to the first page of entries. Line 6 must be the Romulan's arrival. Okay. It looks like they used the transporter and then returned to the arrival area. Perhaps they destroyed the main transporter to prevent anyone else from finding any information about the Unity device. It looks as if the Romulans landed a shuttle in some kind of landing dock as well as beaming in. I wonder why. Or maybe that was someone else. It's a control panel. <laughs> oh, oh, thanks, Jordan. Yeah, yeah. Or... Done. Uh... Accessing. It's a control panel. Uh, please report the number to the system administrator. Okay. It's a control panel. It's a control panel. It is. It's a control. Yeah, thanks, Jordy. It's a control. Wait, it's a control. They're having some. Emergency procedure alpha prohibits maintenance on secondary systems until primary systems are repaired. Initialized, Initialized system. system. Yeah. It's a control panel. No, I. Non recoverable. Okay. Initializing. Boop, boop. Environmental energy maintenance. Cannot proceed to this sector unless maintenance facility. Wait, did we activate security? Alright, so. I activated the thing. Procedure Alpha 324 initiated. This maintenance facility activate facility. Facility activated. All right, I guess we pull it out. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Cool. So. Use passage? Maybe go it on. It didn't work. You gotta walk. Go into passage. I don't see anything. I don't see anything special about any of this. There's just like nothing here. I'd like to take a closer look. Okay. There's something right here, right? It's a piece of thin. A piece of thin sheet metal. Whoa, what the fuck? What the hell is this? We should scan the fuck out of this. A large drone appears to be repairing the smaller one. I noticed an infrared flash transmitted between the two drones. I think it might have been some kind of deactivation signal. We could attempt to duplicate the pulse uh -huh. with the tricorder's output synthesizer. And that might allow us to turn the drones on and off ourselves. Interesting. The system works by separating the factors of the fifth order hyperbolic equation and data just being scanned. Uh, 
It is an automated. The drone is full. Oh, okay. Jackman. Yeah. It is too far. Oh, he's piecing out. Okay, so now we have the scan that we know will get us the. We can deactivate robots. Um. I hate to be kind of a, a questioning Clarence, but did we just get a paper clip? We did just get a paper clip. That's just what happened. It is too far away. Okay, you're right there. Data, please. Get it. Uh, what do you mean it's too far away? I have to be up there probably. Yeah. The platform. yeah. We did just get a paper clip. What's, uh, what's up with that? I don't know. This object appears to be an implement for holding sheets of flexible material together. It is a metal fragment. Metal. It is too far away. What do you mean it's too far away, Jada? There is a Chodak device of some kind. I see no. I am unable. I do not believe. Scan, maybe? I am unable. Logic, logic circuitry detector. Oh. The logic circuit. Wait, wait, wait. I do not believe it. No. Use the logic inhibitor on the door circuits. Yeah, 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 yeah. A little bit down. There you go. Okay. Now. Oh, 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 I got it, I got it. Um, use the tricorder on the drone. Disable it. Take the logic inhibitor. Because it, it detects it. It's, yep. it's, like a, it's like a sliding door. Yeah. We should leave the logic inhibitor here to prevent the door from oh. closing behind us. Okay, sure. If you say so, Picard. Is that how that works? Is that how that works, Picard? Carlstrom is this dude's name? Is, he, is this canon? Is he canon? Carlstrom? Carlstrom? I've never heard of him before. I do not believe... Then Maybe. what do we do with it? Looks like it's already deactivated. The drone block. Oh. So we have to activate the drone? I do not believe. Hmm. Oh, activate. Okay. So now he's sort of doing his thing. But what is he doing? That's my question. You know, his thing. I do not believe. Maybe talk. To Maybe him. this panel has a valid connection to the main database. Thanks. Wow. Did he actually do something worthwhile? Maybe. Display panel. Yeah. Use it. Hey, here we go. Okay, we gotta use the Chodak computer. Power off. Power on. Station online. So what does this do? 
Fucking ancient horror lab. Okay, so <laughs> this is like a drone refueling station. Let me do what I think is very it's obvious. There's a control. And it's a control. What? Okay. Okay, that electricity. Oh, come on. Okay, so we just gotta, like. Data. Oh, God! Data? We'll have to return to the Enterprise. What? Oh, no, no, Our long-range sensors are picking up a sporadic gamma particle trail. We didn't save. We didn't save. We didn't save. Oh. I got rid of the electric. I got rid of the electric that I thought was the electric that was going to get us. Uh huh. And instead, I got hit by this other electric. Uh -huh. That is the most pro. If we assume it's a warbird traveling at maximum warp, it would. We can't afford to leave yet. Crush it to Picard. I've released everyone back to normal duties. Beam down coordinates selected. <laughs> this game is killing me inside. I mean, it's also killing us outside, too. Uh. Yeah. What if we just pretend we don't see this customs robot? Welcome to Eleanor. I want. Bye, bitch. Bye, bitch. Bye, bitch. Uh, bye, bitch. Uh, so we'll just zoom on in there. Okay, great. Uh, okay, so we have to turn that thing off. It did not work. What? Okay, display panel. Okay, so maybe swap it? So we want to turn station offline power on. It was off and off before, right? This seems so dangerous. Definitely. We should save, we should save. In... Sure. Uh -oh. Captain! Oh no, the captain! What? It will crush it to become. Good. Shut everything off. Oh, maybe we already solved the puzzle and we just didn't realize it. Think about it. Because the whole point was we needed the the robot, right? Well, that yeah. Was, that was the whole point, and now the robot's gone. This is still on. It oh. did not work. Oh, I see what we're supposed to do. Okay, 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 okay. It will um, run. Crush it to Good. Okay. Okay, talk to me. Go back out. To? To the out outside. Yeah, go back to the package. Reactivate this robot. So then this thing is going to go through there, right? Yeah. So let's head through. And it's going to eat up the power. Maybe? I thought it was going to come here to get refueled. It did not work. Well, let's let's think about it. Let's scan... Let's well, scan the power thing. If you remember... It appears to be a... Yeah. I it did, appears uh, to... I did this... Then I did that. Mm -hmm. Station online. The dude showed up, if I remember right. Maybe. He sucked up the power. Yeah. So maybe the point is we have to wait, and the power will eventually uh, dissipate, and yeah. then we can go through. We just have to like sit tight for these guys. I think. Okay. Maybe. Okay. That makes sense. Maybe. Maybe. 
maybe. Maybe we leave and come back? Oh, no, there, there we go. Okay. So, okay. So then these guys are going to suck up this shit. One more. And then we go through? Yeah, I guess so. And with no power, then we should be good. Yeah. And then we use the paper clip mm -hmm. to keep ourselves from being electrocuted. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. It might not be that simple. It might be that simple, but it also might not be. And I'll tell you why. Watch. Yeah. Okay. So they suck up exactly three units of power. I do not believe that will work. Ugh. So we have to let it charge to three and then let the and it is a control. immediately disable it. It is a control. But we can't control how much it charges. Yes, we can because it charges... We might have to instantly use it again. Well, yeah, yeah, we'll let see. Me. Oh, okay. Maybe not. It is a control pack. It is a Data, control Data I swear to God, you know what I want to do. Three. The device amplifies a low level. The floor panel is connected to the capacitor. Where is this? Maybe we have to disable it on the panel? I don't think so. Yeah, maybe not. Wait for another one to come. I am unable to come. Yeah, wait for the wait for the last drone to come. And disable it. How am I supposed to do that as it moves? It doesn't move, because remember it only charges if there's enough to actually charge it. Right. So, this next one will come in and just sit there. Because there's not enough power. Right. But then it blocks us. Yeah, then we... Mm, that's true. I am unable we'll to... Wait, wait for it to... There you go. The pulse from the tri... Okay. So now it's stuck there. Mm -hmm. Uh, but we're gonna get shocked. Again. Data! This is such an obtuse puzzle. What's the, it will cut. And I hate that it makes you do this. That's the worst part. Okay. So let's change it. So now we have to turn the computer off again. It did not work. It appears to be. Don't know exactly what I'm trying to do. No, it's like they're being intentionally obtuse. So turn the power off and the station on. Grab the. So what I want to see is. Have we considered grounding the charging plate electrode with the sheet of metal? Are you it's not worth the risk. I see no way. I see no. I see no. Just jump I over no it. Way. Was that it? Was that really it? The fuck Whoa, is that? Who is this? Who is that? What is who this? Where is your master? What the? Um, speak. Uh, I am Captain Jean-Luc Picard of the Starship Enterprise. I have full authority to represent the Federation. 
please follow me, sir. Our master will want to speak with you. Follow um, me, please. Uh, uh, what? This game is so weird. <laughs> I see we have unexpected guests. Uh, okay. Uh, we should talk with Picard as he is the captain. Not, not the rando. Talk to Alien. Can you not see that we are super se- We must not- Oh, we gotta talk to this guy. Greetings. Please do not- Visitors are not shunned. Who are you? I am Captain Picard of the USS Enterprise. U I represent the United Enterprise. Federation of Planets. How did you get here? We detected no other ships in the system. We have always been here. We are the uh, uh, caretakers of this planet. Oh, no. Caretakers? We thought this planet was abandoned oh, long ago. No. We are the descendants of those oh, who survived the no. Civil War. You are Chodak. You have heard of us. What is the purpose of your visit? Uh, we should definitely not tell them that we're here to find the Unity device. That's probably a horrible idea. Uh, yeah, we, we shouldn't say we can't divulge it either. Yeah. Um, uh, we find, find out why two fleets have invaded Federation space. Archaeology, we, right? We're yeah. Just to like, yeah. We are on an archaeological research yeah, expedition. True. You risk war with the Romulans for mere curiosity? The Romulans? Our treaty with the Romulans makes an exception for scientific exploration. Yes, but a Romulan commander wouldn't worry about exceptions to your treaty unless the fight went badly for him. So you have dealt with the Romulans? A Romulan delegation was also here recently. What did the Romulans want? They too claim to be on an archaeological expedition. They proved unfriendly. Perhaps you will be more amiable. Hmm. Uh, yeah. yeah. We are on a peaceful mission. We seek only knowledge. Not of the Unity device. We too are students of history. In fact, we are currently searching for an encryption rod, which will give us access to the computer in the Hall of Records. Probably shouldn't give him that. But, uh, tell me more about it. Like an excellent place to begin. Yeah, yeah. Wall, wall. We should definitely not tell them that we have one. Tell me more about this encryption. There are several types of rods. Gray rods. Gray rods were used by the Securitate. Blue by the Technical Division, and Brown by the Administrative Corps. We need one of the Brown Bureaucratic Rods. Uh, not found any such rods. I wouldn't know about that. We have not found any such rods, but this Hall of Records you mentioned would seem an excellent place to begin our research. The historical archives are stored in a computer, and there is no way to access the data without an encryption rod. experience with the data. Perhaps we can extract the data without a rod. I, I really, I really feel like it's a terrible idea to tell them that we have one. Yeah, but I can't, like, look at... I know. I know. Here's what's gonna happen. He's gonna go yoink, and he's just gonna just take like it Just like the other us. thing, yeah. Yeah. We have expertise in data encryption. Perhaps we can extract the data without a rod. It is not unworthy of a try. Please follow my optimators to the Hall of Records. I am familiar with all known encryption techniques. Yes, your drone could be useful. Don't call him that. Uh, don't trouble yourselves. Because we don't want him to see what we're doing. I guess you're right. They're going to no be pissed. Need to... I cannot let you wander unguided. Okay. Okay. Uh... Perhaps you could lead us to the Hall of Records after all. Perhaps you could take the lead first optimate. Thank you. We are... Take the lead. First Optimator. They're like... I can wait. Oh, okay. Please step this way. We must use the transporter to get to the Hall of Records. Transporter? How can a transporter penetrate the shielding in the walls? Internal transporters are routed through transmission conduits. During the war, special shielding was installed to prevent rebel forces from beaming in assault squads and incendiary devices. 
Rip up those friars. What can you tell us about this planet? What can you tell us? It was once the administrative headquarters of a great civilization. After the Civil War, the planet was abandoned. But your ancestors were left behind. No, what do you mean? He means yes. Oh yes, that's what I mean. We are the caretakers. Mm. Our ancestors were left behind to take I don't care know of the about planet. that. Our ancestors stayed to maintain the world until the Empire rose out of the ashes of its own folly. But it never happened. We are a patient race. The time is nearly at yeah, hand. 900,000 years. What kind of civilization was What this? kind of civilization did you say this was? It was the most powerful civilization the universe has ever seen. We became too powerful. Oh shit. There's an old saying. Absolute power corrupts absolutely. No, that wasn't the cause of our downfall. <laughs> no, idiot. A dissident group of Chodak believed we were abusing our power. The civil war they started threw the Empire into oblivion. Well, this guy. He's here. Hi. Hey. Hi, uh... If you are finished discoursing on ancient history, I believe we have business to attend to. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Our apologies, sir. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. So we gotta teleport. come, giant floaty heads. Yeah. T, T pose out. <laughs> oh, if you'll notice, that's the same sound when we transported on um, uh, the like the music notes thing when we would use the music notes sure, okay. yeah, and show that transporter. Seems very slow. Yeah, one at a time. Yeah, this one at a time thing. Please follow my optimators. Okay. Why am I this guy now? What the? Uh, oh, there's a panel. Please leave the transporter controls alone. Oh, oh, those are the, okay. Is there another door somewhere? Ooh, there was an arrow. Where? Oh, oh, right there. Let me just get Jordy out of the way. Archways. Oh. Can we talk to them? I am not sure you realize what an incredible opportunity this is to be speaking to a living Chodak. I have so many questions to ask. The question reveals the questioner. Ask. Mm. What happened to the Chodak Empire? It seems to have vanished overnight. Surely a civil war couldn't have destroyed such a vast empire so quickly and completely. A small group of Chodak dissidents managed to remove the basis of Chodak power. With this restraint gone, the second-class races of the empire joined in rebellion. Wanton destruction of everything Chodak followed. What was the basis of Chodak power? A weapon? Not a weapon. Although it could be used as one. Rather... <laughs> I thought I ordered you to turn off the security system. I thought I had. There must be... You imbecile. You will never pass your fifth challenge. Oh, Allow me to challenge. rectify my peer's incompetence. Permission granted. Give him the security rod, Optimator 1. Yes, sir. Okay, yes, so sir. Security rods are blue. Um... He's just like taking these bullets to the face. Uh Did he di uh Did he just fucking die? What the hell hey, um, is happening right now? What? Uh, hey, um... Hmm. He must have gotten through. Let's go. Follow me, please. <laughs> ah! 
Hurry, the system may. Hey, uh. <laughs> Did that guy fucking die? Optimator Du is dead, sir. His corpse is unimportant. The main. We should see his corpse his body. is un. I mean, oh. Well, maybe not. It won't even let us. Oh, wow. This. This is the main computer. Uh. If we put. If we take out that. Maybe talk to him? I thought you might not try very hard. Perhaps a little persuasion would help. Optimator 1. Eliminate them one at a time. What the what? fuck? Yes, there. Primus 1? So, you have an encryption rod after all. Good. It has saved your lives. This guy's a dickhead! Oh, let me introduce myself properly. I am Admiral Broadnack, master Admiral. of the Nine Challenges, bearer of the 15th shell of the Chodak Empire, commander-in-chief of the Chodak Starfleet. Thank you for saving me a great deal of time. Computer, search subject. Unity device. Transfer and erase chart 45 NX. Dear tricorder, this is important. What's now, it? play the Unity device file for our guests. Okay, so I remember. Actually, this is one of the things I remember. Is basically. This is the. So they're gonna play a movie. And at the end. From the time the first Chodak grub made his fateful journey to the beauty and freedom of the new shell, first. to the first Chodak in space, to, to the building of our great empire, no achievement compares to the creation of the Unity device. The we culmination of 650 film, years of research, film. development, and construction. I, I don't even know the Unity how to device react right now. opens up the path to a bright no and idea, happy no future for react. all Chodaks. Not at all. It's really quite simple. We de-randomize a quanta of subspace. The resulting predictability is then cascaded to a usable volume with a positive feedback loop. At that point, the hyperwarp accelerator speeds this quanta all the way to warp 17. At that point, of course, the quanta is exactly as large as the universe. It then takes only a minute change in subspace to affect a large and predictable change in real space. Real space. The Unity device is already being used to make the universe a better place for Chodax. It has pacified regions of the Empire facing civil unrest. It has prompted many other races out of ignorance and into full second-class membership in the Empire. The Unity device, newest wonder of the universe, paving the way to a better and brighter future. Such power and it was thrown away. Ages ago, a group of rebellious scientists sent it into the future, claiming it should only be used for celestial engineering. Now the time of its return is near. With the ancient star charts from this computer, we can pinpoint exactly when and where the Unity device will reappear. Goodbye. I feel that in the short time we have been together, what? I have grown almost fond of your species. We will meet again. Uh oh. Soon. Perhaps your federation will qualify for second Soldier class. Soldier Chodak! Our yeah, Chobak! There, Chobak. Chobak I'm ready to show attack. The panel's control program failed. We can access the files. At least something's gone. Uh oh. The Chodak. The Chodak took the isolinear rod and rod programmer with them. Um. That's odd. This panel appears to be active even though there's no isolinear rod. Uh. Hold on. Let's maybe click on them? Chart that one. I'll file the Chodak this. erased the file we need. Now we might not be able to find. Okay. Communicate. 
recommendation of ruling council to emperor Mila's DNA device disappearance. The unity device is gone. The traitors come. Oh, uh, okay. Well, hang on. Look at that. Uh, can use the next letter in the engineer. Treachery, abuse of defense, knowledge of the universe. This is all political discourse on. Yeah, this is just their subreddit. <laughs> Final message The Great Treachery, view. My fellow Chodak. What? I represent a group of concerned scientists who have seized control of the Unity device to prevent further abuse of its powers. Many of you will doubt our motives, but what we do, we do for the Chodak race. We shall not judge our bureaucrats and admirals too harshly, though their acts threaten the existence of the universe itself. Their minds were insufficient to grasp the Oof. danger they caused. We are wow. taking the device to like a place in everyone. time where they will never be able to reach it. Every 456,000 Balchaks, the device Volchuk. will reappear Volchuk, in the normal there. space time continuum. Volchuks is what they Once came the up with. race has developed the necessary intelligence and wisdom, it can reclaim the device. Gart Gimlash out. Gart Gimlash. Gart Gimlash and his 456,000 Balchaks. I guess that's it. Well, um, look at the the look at the Unity device. That one. Okay, go view. Oh wait, no, this is the no, 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 no. We played the newsreel again. Because what I what I thought. From the time the first showed at. Okay, because okay, what I was thinking of was. Remember, they said reports from the something system. Right. So now we might know where it is. If we if we remember the name I'm of that system. I'm still not sure what this Unity device is. The Romulans seem to think it was some. The Unity device file made it out to be a virtual wish machine. The sign. It appears that the ancient Chodak used the device to maintain their empire until a. Yeah. At okay, least we, we know the that. Chodak aren't too far ahead of us. Yeah. Okay. It did not work. It did. Uh. Yeah, the chart's gone. Do we exhibit, maybe? I think we did this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. I just wanted to know what the. The name of the system was. Wait, look at that again? View? Uh. Dar Rorgal Sector. Dar Rorgal. Dar Rorgal. So if we know that, and we know their unit of time, because remember, we have to go to that nebula. We have to like figure out their unit of time. Right. Yeah. There's actually, we got the bad end for this, so we're gonna have to do it the hard way. Okay. Um. So we have to figure out what their unit of time is, and then. I can't make it work. Oh, this is bad. Uh. Actually, I don't know what the paperclip is for. I can't make it work. I don't see anything. Nope. Wow. First off, that's data. Also, there was a wire. Is that what it said? It appears that the ancient Chodak, you yeah, have got to get. I don't see anything. Hmm. Interesting. There's nothing to use there. I guess not. Question mark. We can't be beamed out. Use door? Looks like there's a door over on the right. Oh, that must be the exit. That's it the door appears that, that the ancient we've got to get. That's the door that I tried to use, though. Right? I don't think so. I do not believe that. Oh. Will... What the fuck? Oh, okay. Why the delay, Optimator One? Sir, the security rod is stuck in the panel. We must leave now. 
but now. Yes, sir. This poor guy. Oh shit. Like PNG of Admiral Broadnack in the cockpit. Uh, can we talk to this guy? No, he's dead. We can go examine this him. This Jodak may still be alive. Yo. His injuries are minor. Talk to him. Oh yeah, make it. I might be able to synthesize a stimulant. What happened? Your master left you behind. How long ago did they leave? A few minutes. Then they should be clear. Do you have a security rod? You will need one to turn off the security systems. The code is 3 Lambda Delta. Okay, can she talk? Does she want to tell us anything else? Yeah, I mean... I do not believe that will work. There we go. There we go. Aha. There's a control. Do we, wait, what do we have? A thing? Hmm. It is a control. Can we use the... It is a control. Paper clip? I see no way of using this. It is a control. Maybe the sheet metal? Because we haven't found any... I see no... We haven't found any way I see no... This. I see... What? I do not believe it is a control. This is another. It is a control. What were you saying? Three, did she give us the, the optimum. Oh. All right. Are they gonna be okay out of their fucking mechanical shell? I don't know. I thought that meant that they were dead. They, they were like dead, right? I do not believe. Check the check the panel again. Are we literally just resetting it like that? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I need a minute. I think that's a good stopping point for this game forever. Well, we literally had to reset it with a paperclip. That is like something that if you told kids today mm -hmm. was a solution to a puzzle they would literally be like what the fuck is this i've yep. never had to do this yep wow 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 there's so a control so we put it back in there we go operator profile three lambda delta it is a control pad. Oh, look at this. Oh, we can turn off all the security. It is a control pad. I do not believe. What? Look at. It is a diagram. Of what data? I, of I what? thought this was the security. No unusual reading. Hmm. So I think we turned off all the security. Uh, we probably have to go out the, the door where Broadneck went. Oh, unless we don't. Nice. Okay, so all the security is off. Shell fragment. Cool. All right. I do not believe that will work. No unusual readings. It's a fucking shell that these Chodak people live in. Yeah, What? what is this thing? It's not unusual at all. It's not unusual. It's not unusual. The device is part of the Chodak Optimus. So I'm guessing we gotta get the fuck out of here? Well, I really I mean, 
I'm gonna check this thing up here, right? We can't Terrace? go there. I might be able to. I don't know if there's anything nope. up there. Nope. Can we go through that door that's what next door? to the operator? Mm -mm. Oh, I don't think that's a... I think it's just a decorative door. You know, like a decorative throw pillow. Yeah, no, I get it. <laughs> the fuck was that? Oh, that's a security. <laughs> oh, what? Did we not do it? It was disabled. It was disabled, but... Well, maybe it isn't. I thought... But it was! It was just disabled! We just walked through there! Yeah. We just walked through there! Maybe we have to leave the rod in? We can come back for it if the security system's back on. Nope. We didn't save any of that. Nope. We didn't save any of that! We did. We did. You know, where's the payoff? Bring the strippers and boost! We do occasionally talk about video games. Bring the strippers and boots. Not a lot of video games. Bring the strippers and boots. Oh, thank God, I don't need pants now. Hey, JC, what are you doing? Not much. Making a fortune. It's a production of broadcast. Yeah, now uh, sing music. It's a production of broadcast. Bring the strippers and boots. It's a production of broadcast. Now I'm here to ask and answer one simple question. It's a production of broadcast. You got.